it's done. That it is. You'll note the intact Illuvian. I was correct on that count, at least. Is it still a threat? Can Corypheus use it to travel the Fade? You recall when I took you through my Illuvian, I said each required a key? The well is the key. Take its power, and Mathal's last Illuvian will be no more use to Corypheus than glass. I did not expect the well to feel so... hungry. Don't go any closer, Morrigan. I am willing to pay the price the well demands. I am also the best suited to use its knowledge in your service. Or more likely to your own ends. What would you know of my ends, elf? You are a glutton drooling at the sight of a feast. You cannot be trusted. Of those present, I alone have the training to make use of this. Let me drink, Inquisitor. What training makes you so qualified? I have studied the oldest lore. I have delved into mysteries of which you could only dream. Can you honestly tell me there is anyone better suited? I would be. You lead the Inquisition. This is not a risk you can take. I have the best chance of making use of the well for everyone. Let me drink. You're not concerned about the price. Bound forever to the will of Mithal. Bound to the will of a dead god? It seems an empty warning. Perhaps a compulsion yet remains. Who can say otherwise? I do not fear it, even so. What's to stop you from taking the knowledge and leaving? My word. If that seems insufficient, Corypheus threatens all, even myself. He must be stopped. And who stops you? I, Inquisitor, seek neither immortality nor your life. If anyone is to use the well, it will be me. So you will take what little knowledge you can understand and let the rest go to waste? The Inquisition needs you. Corypheus still endangers us all. I am forever balked by those who believe they know better than I. Drink if you will, for the sake of us all, but steal your will to do it. Magister wishes to rip the veil open. I must learn how to stop him.
You will give me what I demand. Maker, please, don't let it end this way. It is done. I'm pleased to report we won the battle, Inquisitor. When you went through that mirror, Corythius and his archdemon fled the field. I'm not sure why. What he wanted was no longer within the temple. Perhaps. He spent so long trying to get into the temple, he probably couldn't have helped his forces by that point. Then Corypheus is finished. If he is wise, he will hide and rebuild his strength before he attacks again. He will not hide. He won't hide. You hear it. The well speaks to you. It's... Voices. Whispering from so far away I can barely hear them. Oh, if only one who understood such voices had used the well's power instead. Then we'd have to rely on her interpretation of them, and whatever she chose to tell us. Have I not been forthcoming enough for you, Spymaster? I told you what the well could have done, Inquisitor. You should be hearing shouts from the heavens, not whispers. Then help me. Isn't that what you came here to do? Earlier you said you knew what needed to be done next. What did you mean? The dragon is not an archdemon. It's a dragon in which Corypheus has invested part of his power. Kill it, and his ability to jump to other bodies is disrupted for a time. He can be killed. That's no simple task. Corypheus alone is powerful, but where there's dragon... I need to summon Mithal. 
whatever Mithal was, goddess or myth. There, an altar in the wilderness. That's where I need to go. I see you are determined. So be it. Are you certain of this? We have no choice. If Corypheus comes here now... I'll see to Skyhold's defenses in the meantime. Inquisitor. Inquisitor. 